an OSS LLM you know, claims that there is a variation of 7 billion parameters versus 30 billion and 100 billion. What exactly does that signify? So I, I think really uh, at least the thinking right now, you know, there, there's again, we don't understand these things as well as we should have or wanted to. Uh, but the current thinking is that the model is as powerful as the amount of data that is, it has been trained on and, you know, larger models kind of can consume or can compress or present a larger amount of data with high uh, fidelity or with high generalization abilities. And I think we are seeing, you know, that there have been this work on kind of emergent properties of language models that have since been debunked or at least uh, disputed. Uh, but that claims something that I think is fundamentally correct, that at a certain size of model, you start to see emergent behaviors that you don't see at smaller sizes. And depending on the task, uh, that exact boundary in which you see these emergent behaviors or the kind of strong generalization of the model um, starts to occur. So I know for code generation, maybe this happens, you know, at 12 billion. For other tasks, it may happen at 20 billion. And other tasks, it may require 80 billion. But, you know, generally, there's kind of some general agreement that uh, there is an emergent behavior that happens once you cross a certain uh, size threshold. A again, not all tasks are born equal, right? So for some tasks, this can happen at uh, relatively uh, small models uh, of you know single digit billions uh, that, that give you very good uh, behavior or very good results. So Eran, is it safe to say the larger the size, the higher the number of billion parameters? Is that directly proportional? Yeah, the, the, the size is, is measured in, in, the, in the number of uh, billions the data, of, 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 data of, set, of... The size of the data set, basically. Uh, the size of the, no, size data set is measured differently, but a larger model does require a larger data set to kind of feed into it, to, to kind of to train it, to move the parameters, uh, to converge. Uh, it requires more data. So, like, uh, there are these scaling laws that tell you, like, if you want to train a model of size 20 billion, this is the number of, you know, uh, trillion of tokens that you need to show the model. <laughs>